Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Today I have pulled out the Yule Log. If you don't think the Yule Log is going to be in the background of a ton of my videos starting now, you're crazy. When the holiday season starts to kick in, Yule Log is on. It's just, it's just how it goes around here. So if you're new, subscribe down below and there's always going to be a Yule Log. <laughs> I apologize deeply for my voice. My voice is very deep. Um, I'm recovering from the flu. This is my first video I'm filming. Um, I definitely still have the flu right now. I just like I'm going crazy. I literally have been going crazy all week. Like not being able to film, not being able to do anything, but it's been like really good and really humbling for me to just like chill. Um, but anyways, this video, I wanted it to go up a little bit earlier, but got sick so I couldn't really do it. But I've been waiting to open this box literally to film this video for you guys. So it's very first impression situation. I am embarrassingly or proudly, I don't really know which one is heavier, um, a Sephora VIB Rouge member, which means I'm pretty sure it's like the highest like level you can be at, which is terrifying. Um, it just basically means I've been spending a lot of money at Sephora for a very long time, So, and I love Sephora, seriously, so I'm, I'm proud of it, you know what? Anyways, um, I don't know how often they do this, at least once a year they do like a huge you know, VIB sale and the Rouge members get it first and you get an extra 20% off. So I always like to go hard on the, not always, I didn't last year, but this year I was like, there's some things I need to restock on and so there's been some products I've been wanting to try. I really don't buy makeup a lot. If you guys watch my videos, you would know. I really just like buy refills of things. And there was just some things I really wanted to try and they had some really cute holiday gift sets that I wanted to try and maybe gift to some of my friends. So I took full advantage and we've got a nice box right here for you guys and I'm so excited to share I just opened it but I haven't like unboxed anything so it's gonna be kind of an unboxing haul I'll have everything linked down below everything's obviously still on their website um I just got it for a discount and I thought it'd be fun if like you're shopping the sale I don't know if it's still going on actually but either way um they're gonna be doing lots of sales throughout the holidays or if you're looking to buy something for a friend I don't know I'm just so excited about all the goodies I got so without further ado I'm just gonna show you guys what I got. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I wanted to do, I'm trying to do more like themed hauls. So like a Sephora Rouge sale haul or like a Lululemon clothing haul or like athleisure haul, like just make it really specific for you guys to enjoy. So yeah, I don't know if you guys can tell but I've been trying out some different video styles. So I just, I'm so excited. First off, I got the Summer Fridays Merry and Brighter set. This includes all three of the sets or all three of the masks from Summer Fridays. I currently have the Summer Fridays jet lag mask, but I'm almost out of it. It's a great like overnight mask or even during the day, like you put it on at night, you wake up in the morning and your skin is so supple and so soft. I use it on the plane. I literally, it's literally called the jet lag mask. I'll use it on the plane so that my skin doesn't get super dry. Um, I also have been wanting to try out the other two though. So this is a great deal. It's a $90 value and I got it for $64, but then I got 20% off obviously. So the other two masks are the R&R mask, which is a glow mask, and then the overtime mask, which is exfoliate. So I'm really excited to try these two. Let me know if you guys have tried um, either of these two down below. Um, but yeah, one's exfoliating, one's hydrating, and one's glowy. So I'm really excited to try these out. I've been wanting to try out Tatcha skincare. A lot of you guys have been telling me about it. Um, they have a ton of great products, and I just asked a ton of my friends like that use it, like if I were to get like one product from Tatcha Skincare, what should I get? And a lot of people told me to try the Dewy Skin Cream. I guess um, Kim Kardashian's like makeup artist Mario or whatever like collaborated with them or something or he promotes this product heavily. Um, and it, I mean, it's just like a beautiful jar and it's just a, I, I can't get enough of moisturizers, serums, like I love that. And this says, the Dewy Skin Cream, ultra hydrating and anti-aging, replenishing Japanese purple rice for dry skin. I should have put this on before I did my makeup, but um, yeah, it's got a little purpley tint to it. I have like no sense of smell right now, so I don't know why I even tried to smell that. But I'll let you guys know, obviously, how all these products go. Um, I'm really excited to play around with them, honestly. I got another beauty blender because it's good to just get new beauty blenders every now and then because it's kind of gross. Um, and I actually got a black one this time. I got like the True Beauty Blender brand. I've also gotten like the Real Techniques from Ulta and stuff like that. Um, so yeah, we're gonna see. But yeah, I just got a black one because I feel like it's very chic. I got this Way Hair Care Texturizing Hairspray because I got a mini one. I don't remember why I got it. I got it in some something I don't know I had it somehow from like a PR thing 
and I'm obsessed with it. It's so great with when you curl your hair. I have the mini one for travel, but I really want to start using this just when I curl my hair. It is so light on your hair. You can barely feel it. It smells so good, but it gives your hair that perfect texture, tossly look when you curl your hair. So I'm obsessed with this. Literally, you don't feel like it's hairspray. I know everyone says that, but like you really don't. I also, um, I used to use Moroccan oil products all the time, and then I just like stopped. And I really just love Moroccan hair products. I like how they make my hair feel. They smell so good. They're soft, everything. So I'm always looking for new heat protectant. Um, I just, I'm, I'm really, I obviously have blonde hair now, and I do use heat on my hair. I just can't not. It's really hard for me. Um, so I'm going to try out the Moroccan Oil Perfect Defense Thermal Heat Spray, a dry weightless argan oil infused spray that protects against thermal damage up to 450 degrees to maintain healthy hair. Love that. Very important. Okay, I'm so excited about this. I love just all their holiday stuff. Um, so I got the Fenty Beauty Glossy Posse Mini Gloss Bomb Collection. Um, these are all the Fenty lip glosses. They are freaking awesome. I'm not a huge lip gloss, lip gloss person, except for the Fenty lip gloss. I have like the standard one. I don't remember what it was called, but just like the one that everyone has, like just like the light pink tint. But I didn't realize that she had so many new colors out. And I think these are like a little bit more mini. Yeah, and they're just so beautiful. These are gonna be great for the holidays. Just like add a little spice to your life. Um, so yeah, I think this is the one I have. Um, but I wanted to try out all of these. Brooke talks about these all the time. They make your lips look really good and luscious. So here for that. I got a refill of the It Cosmetic CC Cream because I had to. Um, I'm in the shade light medium, if anyone was wondering. Also, I'm trying out the It Cosmetics Heavenly Skin CC Plus Skin Perfecting Brush. You can apply CC cream with it, foundation with it, um, and I watched like a ton of video tutorials actually of people like putting on face makeup with this brush. And I was very intrigued and it looked like a very airbrush finish. I usually like to use Beauty Blender, but every now and then I like to spice it up. So I wanted to try out this brush. This feels like such like an OG YouTube video. <laughs> Okay, this I'm really excited about. I've heard people talk about the Dior Lip Tattoo, um, so I wanted to try this one out. This is the Dior Addict Lip Tattoo Long Wear Colored um, Tint in the color Natural Red. And this is supposed to like be like a matte finish, but it's all supposed to like kind of like tattoo slash tint to your lips. So it's not like a super intense red from what I understand. It's more of like a lip stain. I don't know. I haven't tried it out. I'm nervous to put it on right now. Um, but I'm really excited. I think it'll be great for the holidays. Wow. I just can't believe it's the holidays Like I'm full-on like red turtleneck. Let's go. Wow. I'm really hungry right now Okay, this is so extra of me, but I just the holiday sets. I can't pick uh. I got the Ole Henriksen OMG also known as oh my glow um, Set because I love Ole Henriksen and I've only ever tried really the truth serum Right there and I always run out of it and I always just don't want to buy it because it's so expensive But this was a set and this allows me to try a ton of their other stuff that you guys have told me about So this comes with the truth serum a full size of the truth serum. So I'm here for that So I'm paying for that and I get all this too. What the heck love that comes with the sea rush brightening gel cream Banana bright eye cream and banana bright face primer. I'm excited to try the face primer I actually didn't really know they had a face yeah. primer. This is I love any Sunday Riley skincare I got the Sunday Riley Luna sleeping night oil um, and it's got retinol in it. I believe Yeah, next generation retinoid oil reduces the appearance of pores and wrinkles while fighting the signs of premature aging and surface redness um, I have like a very mini one of this and I bring it with me when I travel. It is the best night serum ever. It's literally blue when it comes on your fingers. It's kind of scary. Um, but I feel like it's doing a lot for my skin. It smells really good and I feel like it's just like resurfacing my skin overnight and it's just amazing. So I finally got the big size. Hair stuff. I got a, the Olaplex number no. 7 bonding oil. I have the Olaplex shampoo conditioner, the bond smoother, and then also another bond maintenance. Thing. So I wanted to add something else to my collection. This is the bonding oil. Olaplex is great for your hair It's what a lot of hair salons use a lot of the hair salons I go to um, they really recommend Olaplex It's great for colored hair, especially it just kind of like maintains your hair and this oil is supposed to reduce frizz Extend color new vibrancy. It's also a heat protection Just a ton of great things and it's just like in this little container and I think it's awesome Olaplex is great again. I'll let you guys know how all this stuff goes if you guys see it in upcoming favorites videos then you know it's good stuff also i'm literally sitting on a pillow and i keep shrinking next step i'm trying a new bronzer i always just go for the same bronzers i like the one i have right now 
um, but I wanted something a little bit more matte. Um, this is the Bobbi Brown bronzing powder in the color natural. I read the reviews. So many people rave about this bronzer. It's just like a go-to. Um, and you guys will see, it's nothing like crazy. It's just a simple brown bronzer. Um, but I'm really excited to play around with it, do a little contouring action, just like add some color to my face when I don't want like a ton of shimmer. Um, again, I, I haven't tried it yet. I haven't tried any of this stuff yet, but I'm really excited. Um, I really did read the reviews and everyone liked it. That's why I tried it. Oh, oh this is a big exciting. I've wanted to try this for like years, ever since Tori De Simone talked about it like ages ago in her like makeup period of time. Um, I want to try it. Everyone's like, it's so overpriced. Like, don't get it. But like, everyone that uses it, their skin looks amazing. And I wanted to treat myself to like a nice, um, heavier foundation than like a CC cream for like, just like holiday things and give myself a little glow. So I'm trying out the Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Foundation. I had so much trouble figuring out what shade I was. Sephora is awesome and they have like a ton of my saved shades. And I guess I got some color IQ test at one point when I was there. So I just kind of based it off that. We'll see. This is kind of like for when I have spray tan, um, which I do a lot in the winter. But yeah, this is a very nice foundation. I got it because obviously I got the discount this time. So I'll let you guys know. I got this to use with this brush. So we're gonna try these two out. This brand has popped out at me a lot when I've been into Sephora. This is Natasha Denona. Um, I just wanted like a simple everyday neutral eye palette that I could bring with. I've recently gotten into eyeshadow lately. I, well not even, I just put like bronzer on my lid. Started, I like did some people's makeup recently and I was like, wait, this is kind of fun. Like a nice neutral smoky eyes fun. And I love my Naked palette, but it's just huge. And this palette was just perfect. It had every single shade I could possibly want. Fits in my makeup bag for travel, because I'm about to do some traveling. I am so excited. So this is the Camel palette. Um, and obviously the color is getting a little washed out. But I just like it because it's got like, you know, a cream color and then some like neutrals. The swatches on Sephora's website looked amazing. Like, oh my god, so pigmented. So I'm really excited to try these out. I will let you guys know. And I like how it has like a fun little shimmery bronze if you want to spice it up. But I thought this was perfect. I could put that in the crease or like the inner inner crease and this like an all over crease lid. You know, just like play around with it. I'm really excited about this palette. Last, but certainly not least, this is a refill. Oh my god, oh, I thought there wasn't anything in there. I was like, oh my god, chips. This is the Anastasia Brow Definer Triangular Brow Pencil. I love this. I switched back and forth between this and the Milk Makeup like eyebrow gel, but for some reason, when it gets colder out, I like to have more defined brows, so I like to like draw them in kind of, or like fill them in. This is just amazing. There also is one from Bobbi Brown I like, I don't really care. One end, it's just got the spoolie, so you can shape them. And then this is a brow pencil, but it's angled, which is so much easier to like fill in instead of just like one like like a mechanical pencil. I love it. They last a while, um, and it's my fave. We finished. Oh my gosh, I'm like so tired. Well, I haven't talked this much all week, <laughs> so be excited. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you got something out of this. I had so much fun. I feel like it's Christmas. Um, I'm very thankful that I obviously get to purchase stuff like this. Um, and yeah, if you're shopping the sale, you can check it out for yourself too. Or if you're just buying things for friends, whatever it may be. Um, but yeah, I love you guys. I have everything linked down below for you guys to shop yourself. I'm kind of on a makeup grind right now. It's kind of fun. Um, comment down below any holiday videos you want to see. I have some in mind that I'm already going to do. But I want to film videos that you guys want to watch. So, and Vlogmas is starting soon. Oh my god. I'm going, I'm going to get no sleep. <laughs> No sleep. All right. I love you guys so much. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you soon for our next video. Peace out. That was so weird. Okay. Bye.